Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh uh, How are you guys? I hope you are doing well uh, uh, First, let me introduce myself My name is Rafli Kurniawan from English Literature B uh, Today, I will present about obesity problem in Indonesia Next slide, they are my topic about this presentation first is introduction in the introduction i will tell you about what is obesity and how does it happen and the second in presentation i will tell you about cause of obesity provide data of obesity in indonesia and last is the impact of obesity and next is conclusion because in conclusion i will tell you about how to avoid the obesity next what is obesity according to who obesity is a accumulation of fat exercise due to an imbalance of energy with energy used for a long time and why obesity occurs overweight and obesity occur due to higher energy intake than energy expend high, high energy intake is caused by consumption of food source of energy and high fat well low energy expenditure is due to lack of physical activity and sedentary lifestyle or habit life lack of motion the next is cause of obesity first is genetic factor if one of the parents is obese the, then the chance of the child are obese is 40 until 50 percent and if both parents are obese, the chances are 70 until 80 percent. A rare example of a genetic problem is prader willi syndrome. Next is overeat. An excess amount of energy intake leads to overeat and obesity. Types of foods that are high in fat, sugar and less fiber can cause an energy imbalance. Next slide is less moving. A person who tends to consume fatty food and does not do a balanced physical activity will be obese. Uh, next cause is drug side effects several types of drugs that can cause weight gain are antidepressant antipsychotic anticonvulsants and corticosteroid and diabetes drugs next slide is data obesity in indonesia and this data is adults in age more than 18 in 2007 is 10.5 percent and 2013 is 14.8 percent and next is 2018 is 21.8 percent Based on the 2018 basic health research or risk status data, the prevalence of obesity in Indonesia over the age 18 is around 21.8%. Uh, this data tends to increase from 10.5% in 2007 to 14.8% in 
in 2013 and increased to 21.8% in 2018. This data shows the higher of number uh, sorry the higher the higher number of obese people in Indonesia. Next slide is this is a high five percentage of obesity in adult age more than 18 years by province in 2018. Uh, the highest prevalence was found in North Sulawesi with 30.2% uh, and next is DKI Jakarta with 29.8% Next is East Kalimantan with 28.7% Next is West Papua with 26.4% uh, Next is Rio Islands with 26.2% and followed by other provinces the next slide is the impact of obesity. The first impact is depre depression. Obesity can also trigger depression. People who feel they people who people who feel that they are fat or overweight tend to get stressed more easily because Feelings, feelings of inferiority are one are one of the factors driving people to become stressed more easily. Next is snoring. Patient will experience sleep disorder that are identical to snoring. Uh, this is due to the accumulation of fat on the neck and pressing on the upper airway especially when sleeping lying down which puts people at risk at risk of at risk at risk for snoring and next is diabetes more than 87 percent of people with diabetes are overweight or obese one of the danger of obesity to watch out for is the change in cell in cell properties that cause the insulin hormone to be damaged and unable to detect sugar in the blood if this condition persists it is not impossible if that you will uh, experience to type 2 diabetes mellitus. Uh, next is shortness of breath. What is experienced by obese people is that difficult to breathe and their breath uh, tends to be short uh, caused by the accumulation of fat in the chest and neck area so that you have difficult to breathing either to inhale or exhale air uh, next is the last is heart disease people who are Overweight and obese have a higher risk of developing heart disease than those who are not. Uh, this is because obesity triggers high blood pressure, high cholesterol, and high blood sugar in the body. Uh, These three conditions increase the work load of the heart so that heart has
has to work harder and over time it can malfunction next is conclusion in conclusion i will tell you about how to avoid the obesity the first is exercise regularly if we exercise we can burn our fat in our body uh, next is we should choose a healthy food uh, and the last is we have to get sleep enough and that's all from me if there are any mispronunciation i'm so sorry uh, thank you Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh